Okay, y'all. I'm uh in this land at uh Walgreens. I went to the other Walgreens. Let me get this out of my car because I don't like trash in my car. I'm gonna put it all over there. When I get in the garage, I clean it out. But um, yeah, I went to Hardy's. Uh, well, first, let me explain something. Went to the doctor today. Well, you know, I already had a doctor's appointment. First, I said, you know, Deborah, don't go. Because they trying to kill you. Don't worry about it. But uh, I went on. And, um. Uh, what my credit card? My business card. Um. I went on and uh, spoke with my doctor. She wrote everything down. She's one of the type of people. She puts everything in the computer. She write it down. And she wants you to go over. She said she had all the notes from the emergency room. But she want to go over. She want to make her own notes. And she don't like when you tell her something. She she, she likes to sit and t type everything. Y'all, it's funny. But I love her to death. She's a good dog. So we went by one by one about my, my steps. So she uh, checked me for uh, and this. Uh, Cause I never thought about the chills and the cough and the runny nose and mucus and all that stuff could be anything about bronchitis, but duh. And um, y'all know I've been out the medical field for years. And um, then she um, she wrote me a prescription for doxycycline because I'm allergic to penicillins and sulfurs and sulfur. And some people say sulfur, sulfur. Some people say sulfur. So whichever way you want it. But any penicillin, I can't touch it. So she gave me doxycycline. And uh, she gave me a cough medicine with a codeine in it. She did that because she said that'll help my cough. And that'll, you know, rid that pain until she get me to another rheumatologist. Because her thing is the knots in my legs and the pain normally arthritis is in your bones not your skin and stuff like that so she said i just want to make sure you don't have lupus or something like that so and uh so i said cool she referred me to somebody else so i soon know about that you guys when i go and um i want to thank all y'all for sending me the well wishes and saying we pray I'm okay and all that stuff. Thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. Thanks to all my subscribers who just joined the page and listened to me when <laughs> my grandbaby said, "Why did you make that cleaning video?" I was cleaning. I know I'm not the most attractive thing to look at when I'm cleaning, y'all. I know that, but I was cleaning. I want to clean just like y'all. Anyway, y'all. I found me an outfit. Y'all know I ain't into those, uh, what they call it, sequins and all that stuff. But I said, you know what? I'm getting old. I'm going to more upscale parties. They wear a lot of that mess. Let me put some on. Um, well, I bought a jumpsuit because I, I still like to be cute, but I like to still stay in my lane of what I like. You know, I'll never wear this outfit again, never. But uh, it's a sequence at the top. And then. It's just plain black at the bottom. I went and found me a pair of black sh uh, shoes with a little heel on it because I told my husband some stuff got to have heel. Um, so it's a, this is the Southern Heritage Classic Weekend, y'all. Y'all know that's a big thing in Memphis. Uh, my best friend is over the big fashion show. Um, I can't think of the guy named Fred somebody. Y'all know I'm not good at night. But anyway, um, he's one of our big supporters. Well, the, um, I don't know who all the party, because I never went to the party. I don't think so, because every time I'm always sick this time of year, and it's starting again. And uh, But I'm going to make it tomorrow. I'm going to hang with the big wigs. Now, I have to go home and figure out which hair I'm going to put on my head. And when I figure out which wig I'm wearing, y'all, and I uh, put my dress together, I'm not doing it tonight. I'm laying down again tonight. Because I, I still can't walk. But uh, the not feel. No, it don't feel better. But 
I'm just gonna put some more ice on it and pray that it feels better. How about that? But I seen all y'all on her winter holidays. It didn't give me no dessert. Y'all know I'm a donut for freak. The Fruity Loop. Fruity Loop Donuts from Hardee's, y'all. I stood in a long line. No, I was the only person in the line. Then nobody don't answer the phone. And then they look crappy. But still, that's Memphis for you. And you get five mini donuts. Let me see. There you go. So, y'all see my donuts so messed up with the stuff off of it. I should have made them give me another. Mmm. It tastes just like Fruit Loop. But you know what? It reminds me of. My husband used to make my children a dessert. He would use a plain donut. And he would put whipped cream and strawberries on it. Y'all, that was the best dessert ever. That's what these donuts taste like. I know I carry water wherever I go. <coughs> May I take that out of the video? <coughs> this cough is running me crazy. Uh, well, anyway, they do taste like um, Fruit Loops. And even though I know they all taste like Fruit Loop, I'm going to taste each one of them because I can. <laughs> mm. But y'all, they ain't no to plain donuts. Uh, and they got some frosting. They made them like a, not like a frosting frosting, but you know, like the liquid frosting that you make up out of confessional sugar. That's what it is. And they put a little flavor in it. Mmm. Y'all know why I do taste that? So I give me something sweet. As of today, there will no be no, after today, no sweets. I'm going to enjoy my bite of each donut. Y'all got to lose weight. I got to be serious because it's affecting my health. And um, my cousin, cousin Ian, y'all know her. She um, <clears throat> she um, go to a trainer, personal trainer, and he um, he. I forget. Oh, he gave her meal plan. So I, I'm using her meal plan. I went to Kroger today. Y'all had the hardest time getting through that store. I went. I tried three chairs out. Do you know the motorized chair? I'm going to call the insurance company tomorrow to try to get me my own motorized seat. Only thing I didn't want, they hooked up to my car. But you know what? Sometimes you got to do what you got to do. And uh, that is cold in here. I'm getting them chills again. That's what it is. But, um, I don't even know what I was talking about. Oh, what was I talking about? <laughs> well, anyway, y'all. Um, yeah, I hope the outfit turn out cute tomorrow. I hope one of my wigs are pretty. I'm gonna go home and, uh, just lay down for tonight and take my medicine. She said the coating should help the pain in my leg so I can get around at least until she get me to uh, I know this lady think I'm crazy talking to myself at least until she get me to uh, the other rheumatologist so thank God for that I got a good doc you know and I always said it was something more than uh, rheumatoid because most people who take steroids as many as I do I get the shots and I take the pill you shouldn't be uh, getting no pains, you know, like I do, you know. Otherwise, it's worthless for me to be gaining all this weight for no apparent reason. You know, ain't no point in using steroids if they're not going to do the job they're set out to do. So, <clears throat> we're going to see how that work out, y'all. But, yes, I had um, 
I have bronchitis. <clears throat> we figured that part out. And now all we got to do is figure out. Um, we, all we got to do is figure out now what what's going on. Why the pain? So, and the knots. And it wasn't just me. My husband felt the knots. And when he went to the emergency room, he was saying it yesterday. Because, you know, they were veering off, talk crazy. And my husband said, I'm the one who felt the knot. It was there. You know, they try to think, make you think because, oh, you you got uh, authorized. You, you just don't understand. You're going to always have pain and all that stuff. My, my husband, like, she was in pain. It was not there, you know. But these doctors now, they don't care about you. But I do got a good um, primary care doctor now. Her name is Dr. Murdy, M-U-R-T-I. She is so cool, y'all. She just like a hip young girl, and she's sweet as pie. And uh, so we're going to, uh, she says she just wants a second opinion of what's going on with me. She wants every test we did. And so thank God that I got her. Thank God she's in my life. But anyway, y'all, uh, I got one more do donut to bite. I should have the whole donut. But they little, y'all. They little bitty. Look at them. These are little bitty donuts. Just by my eye. They ain't gonna be. But, um, they taste that fruit loop, y'all. I've been wanting to taste them ever since I've seen uh, Shea Marie and Blog, Family Blog. She put them on there early morning. I said, no, she did. I said, no, you didn't put them donuts on there. You know I like donuts. Don't do that. <laughs> I stay away from donuts shop, hamburger shop. I stay away from them because I love them. And then uh, Ursula with the Ursula with five 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 crafts. She did it too, when she did. It, I was okay. This is too much. I got to go taste the donut. I got to go taste it. Y'all, they good. They what a dollar. <clears throat> Uh, they were dollar ninety nine cent, and you get five donuts, and it comes in the fruit loop package. It comes in the fruit loop pack with the hearty sign. Y'all go get some. Bye, y'all. Peace out. And thank y'all again if I haven't said it for all your prayers last night. I'm just saying good positive things keeping me going. Cause sometimes y'all. I don't be feeling good. I don't be doing too good either. But, you know, I try to keep up face for the camera. And, um, but, you know, you feel one way, but in your mind it's another way. I, I, I was to the point yesterday that I was so tired of being in pain. I was just, I was tired of it. I'm, I'm over it. You know what I'm saying? And I don't, I have not complained. I've been uh, dealing with it since 2000. It happened right after I had, well, I showed signs as a young girl. And then it started back hitting me up when I got older, but I ain't paid that much attention. But then at one point, it just went bang, knocked me down. I couldn't walk for days. And um, I've been dealing with the pain since 2009, a little bit before then, but I'm going to say 2009. I've been dealing with that pain. I have not complained. When the doctor keeps saying, oh, it's just room to it. Oh, it's just authorized. Oh, I'm just going to give you a steroid. Oh, I'm just going to. And I just dealt with it. I just sat up and I looked at him and I dealt with it. But I'm, I, I'm tired. I'm to the point I'm tired. You know, but um, but thank you guys. It uplifted me. And I went to bed and stopped crying like a baby. And uh, I'm going to show y'all. If I if I turn out cute tomorrow, you'll see a video. If I turn out looking frumpy, you won't see a video. But I got a few dresses I want to, a few outfits I want to try on. But I think that outfit is going to be the outfit, the going outfit that I bought today. But anyway, you guys, remember to live your life. Life is short. And it's showing no dress rehearsal. Pray for my hair, y'all. Bye now.